<laughs> That's life. Said Mohammed Birhan spared no expense when building this luxurious villa on the heights of Addis Ababa. That's the gym and the sauna. Here you have the living room and the kitchen. It's only a small part of the house. Birhan is one of the richest men in Ethiopia. Inside his house, everything screams of opulence. And on the wall okay. hangs a picture of Birhan's idol, Warren Buffett. Uh, this year, uh, Bill Gates, how many million? I don't know. More than 80 million. Yeah. Uh, Warren, Warren Buffett, 65 billion. And you? More than. <laughs> <laughs> Birhan belongs to Ethiopia's new generation of millionaires. He bought this factory 20 years ago and has since become the king of clothing. There aren't many clothes factories in Ethiopia. This one's the biggest. Though often associated with famine and poverty, Ethiopia has in fact seen its economy grow 10% yearly in the past decade. Its number of millionaires has also increased by a staggering 140 per cent. There are now over 3,000 of them in the East African country. Catering to these new expensive tastes, a new $5 billion housing project recently sprung up on the outskirts of the capital. In this US-styled gated community, a villa costs upwards of $500,000. Despite its growing number of super-rich, Ethiopia remains one of the 20 poorest countries in the world. Over a third of its population still lives below the global poverty line.